Continuous Professional Development Program for Non-Option Science Teachers 2021 Inquiry Approach in Teaching Science Engage first. Think of this. Have you ever wondered what caused some objects to float while some sink in the water? Here we have an empty bottle, a red pen, a pencil, a plastic spoon, a scissors, an eraser, a marble, and a wooden block. Now, we are going to put all the objects into the container filled with water in half. Then, we are going to test it out for engage phase. Are you ready? Let's go! Engage phase. Explore the result. Are you ready? Let's go! Now, this is the whole process I put all the objects into the water. First, marble, sink. Next, the second object we are going to put into the water is an eraser. Let's go. It sink. Next, a scissors. It sink too. Next, how about a red pen? Is it going to sink or float? It floats. Next, we are going to put a pencil. It sink or float? Yes, it floats. Then, followed by a plastic spoon. Is it going to float or sink? Yes, you can see that. A plastic spoon is sink. Next, how about a wooden block? Is it going to sink or float? Yes, it's float. So, you can see all the objects we have tested. Okay, it's going to show the result. The last one is the bottle. Plastic bottle. Is it going to sink or float? Yes, it's float. Alright. So get a clear view of all the object that we have already observed. Okay. So now we can see that a plastic bottle is float. A pencil is float. Alright. Then you can see that at the bottom we have a scissors, a plastic spoon, an eraser, and a marble. Alright. Then okay, all this object is float on the water. Okay. Take a clear view. I have a question for you. What caused the object to float? And what caused the object to sink? Think about it. And we are going to explore more in the next phase. Thank you.